Last week, it was announced that Harry, 36, is set to publish a literary memoir next year, promising to be an accurate and wholly truthful account of his life. However, Prince William is said to be concerned by the news, and one royal expert had claimed Harry's new project could be especially damaging for his brother. Ingrid Seward, editor-in-chief of Majesty magazine, said this week that Harry could say inappropriate things about the firm, with terrible consequences for William. She said, William is probably the one that will come out of this worst of all because there is a row between William and Harry and basically if Harry says things that are inappropriate about the monarchy, that is William's future. It's not Harry's future. He is out of it now, but it is William's future. Harry and William's relationship has been strained since the Duke and Duchess of Sussex decided to leave royal duties behind. But the brotherly fallout is also said to have deeply affected Kate, the Duchess of Cambridge, who was left devastated by the feud according to one royal expert. In August last year, royal author Andrew Morton told New Idea. There's no doubt the rift between Harry and William has deeply affected Kate. It upsets her. Meanwhile royal commentator Phil Dampier said the release of Finding Freedom, a biography on the Sussexes, would do little to heal the relationships between the couples. He said, I'm told that the pair are speaking at the moment, but the conversations are stilted and difficult. The biography caused a stir when it was published due to claims made about the Cambridges and their role in the royal fallout. The book told of Meghan and Harry's final official appearance as royals in March 2019, where they joined Kate and Will for the annual Commonwealth service at Westminster Abbey. As William and Kate made their way to their seats in the front row, Meghan gave them a little wave, but the book claims she and Harry were met with little response. Authors Mr. Scobie and Ms. Durand claimed Harry and Meghan felt snubbed at the service, saying in an interview, a lot of damage has been done. The book also claimed that Kate did very little to bridge the divide between the divided brothers, although it was not necessarily her responsibility. Royal expert Mr. Morton added that Kate had definitely sided with her husband, but acted as a loyal wife. As for Kate and Meghan's relationship, royal expert Emily Andrews claimed Meghan felt Kate had given her the cold shoulder, but added that the Duchess of Cambridge may have been none the wiser to this. She said, here were two women, both outsiders, marrying into the royal family, living on the same complex at Kensington Palace, of course they'd be besties. Behind the scenes, Meghan was feeling a bit rebuffed. I'm not sure whether Kate ever realised. William had said to Harry before they got engaged, no need to rush this. You've got all the time in the world. You don't know her that well, and I think that set the seeds.